uh, even if my life is threatened, I'll have to decline it after experiencing what I have experienced for the past five years. However, if, if, if anyone that was in the far-left government had repented and are looking for that transition of representing religion instead of politics, then that's a different matter altogether. They don't identify themselves as far left lefties anymore, loony lefties anymore, uh, lunatics anymore. They, they could be cured. It is possible, as the example of that Rahab, the prostitute of the story of Joshua in the Old Bible and also as the example of M Mary Magdalene in the New Bible, the New, New, New Testament. And the, literally, there are, the old books are older and the new books are, uh, are newer uh, within the gap of... Um, 700 years or 500 years uh, so that's why they call the new and the old um, but everything in history and the future is already predestined and the non-religious and the godless people hate me saying that because uh, the Jews have had a case of genocide happen in their lives. I'm not Jewish, but I am a Christian that loves Jesus. And I know that the modern Jews today and around the world a half caste European and whites. So the the real Jews didn't look African. I mean there are some real Jews in Africa. I mean more closer to the they were close they were closer to to Moses and they were closer to But the fact is, the ancient, the ancient Jews were in fact wiped out by genocide, the same as Australians and the Native Americans. Um, so why am I talking about the Jews? because they're, they're the example for all religions, including Muslims. So, children of Abraham, God of... The children of Abraham, many of the Muslims are the same as Jews in the Jewish category. Or the, their relatives, they're children of God. So no wonder their race has been attacked the most, which is the Arab race. Um, not Indian race. Indian race is similar to England. Um, which make slaves and they make um, they make capitalism and also where the far right is guilty of so they have created capitalism where they've split the society in in bits and pieces scattered all over the place based on how much money you've got in your bank um, so that's what they've done and how much money you earn per 
per year which is capitalism to be judged by bad judges on everything negative because you're not earning enough money per year is totally out of order this is what happened to me oh dear so I had double trouble torture for my race and up being unable to stand up again on my own two feet to be able to work to find a job to find further education all of that has been blocked in my life so I couldn't have a normal life and it it was done by the far left government, not the far right. It was done by the far left government uh, and its people. But the one that had implemented its action is the far right government and its judges. So both sides are my enemies. So I have been saying, let's overthrow the government. We don't want the left government. We don't want the right government. We don't want the centre government. Get rid of all of them. I'm the authority. I'm in, I'm in control of my own life. Get rid of them. And um, I couldn't agree more. Because of them, every, we've made no progress. We're, we're not evolving, as they say. We're devolving. We're not more intelligent. We're more stupid as, as, a, as, a, as, as a society worldwide. Wasting money on weapons. Wasting time on false education wasting my effort to try and justify myself when there is no there is no reform there is no democracy and so what's the point of a government when they're driven on the street the people in general who are most vulnerable to make protests and or to make um, civil unrest and civil war so this is the consequences of having a corruption in the government via bad judges and, and bad hypocrisy I think they call that um, uh Slave masters, slave masters come from the far right government. So the slave masters, the far right government, and the far left government are the slaves. No wonder they don't like each other. What the hell is that? So it is a false religion. People say, oh, religion made the war and it's the cause of all war. No, it is politics, judges, doctors and nurses who made us all go mad. So they're driven to create civil war and civil unrest make the population depopulate based on the authority of the devil not the authority of God they don't have God's laws anymore they've scrapped that and put people on the street to make protests and to, to make killings 